So Friday night, I'm on my load uh, about 50 miles away from, well, I picked up 25 miles away and I had to drive 50 miles from the pickup to the drop off. It's a, it's a night. I leave, I'm like on the way and I realize that the truck, the box truck itself, the trailer, the lights on top of the box, all dead, came, not working. The tail lights, they're not working. So I drove, the brake lights was working. Um, the hazard lights was working. So I drove all the way with the hazard lights on. I'm talking about turnpike, everything, about 50 miles from the pickup point. This is at night, mind you. So I realized when I got to my drop off, it was about 2.30 in the morning. Then I was like, wait a minute. It was the roof. Well, I messed it up. The wire goes around it. So the, right, the wire was in there trapped and it was just cutting it. So I put it out, joined it back together. The lights was working, drove back home. But now check this out. We're about to fix the roof. Check it out. All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So we got some stuff right now. We got the new cap, we got the tools. All right, so basically we have to take this whole thing off. Well, this is off already. So we gotta take this off. We gotta take that off. We gotta take that off, take that off. The other side is already taken off. So once we take the cap off, clean that up and we'll put the new cap on. Hello guys. So today, it's a fan, another family day. And we are at David's parents' house. And he's trying to fix the truck. Let me show you guys. Okay. He's got the new cap. No, not the bowl. That's pretty good. All the tools are just gonna try to fix it up. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Taking the Gorilla duct tape off. You know how strong that stuff is? <laughs> right? Gorilla glue? <laughs> soccer oh oh be careful getting ready for soccer yeah <laughs> kick it to me Good job. you have to hold the phone side all right so the cap is almost off, as you can see. We took everything off. Now we just gotta do the other side, but this thing is almost off. So once we take that off, we're gonna clean this stuff off and we'll put the new cap on. Um, yeah, all right, so there we got the cap off. We gotta take that little light. We're gonna have to get a new light though, but I'm gonna use this for now just to have it on there just for now. Then we'll change it up later. But uh, yep, the whole cap is off now. So now we just have to clean that up and put a new cap on. All right, man, your boy got the cap off. Um, we straightened it up a little bit. That side was all jammed up. It's out now like that. Side right there, heat it up pulled it out the corner right there is not gonna be perfect so we're gonna just have to you know eventually find somebody to uh, to do something about that but um the, the top part I put the roof back it was out a little bit so I put it back in there we're gonna have to figure out find somebody who could do fiberglass uh, let me show you real quick Ugh, try not to fall over here but um Right here, this whole side was this whole part right here was out, so I put it back in. And as you can see, right here, it's not gonna be perfect. So, duct tape over there, 
Then over here, we made it straight. We're gonna put this part back. The cap is gonna cover here. So the cap is gonna, you took it off? Yeah. All right. So the cap is gonna come over here. Once we put the cap, this will go down. The cap will come over here, co cover this whole part right here. We might have a little opening over here. So we're gonna have to duct tape right there. Eventually we're gonna have to find somebody to fix it, but um, we'll see how it look at, at the end. All right, so I got the cap and I had to drill a hole right in there so I could put the light back on. And after that, we'll clean the top up and then we'll put it on. Eventually I have to buy the light cause it's a little broken on this side, but we're gonna just put that back on there. All right finally finished hey man it's not perfect but it looks perfect um, it took longer than I thought to fix it this is going on second day I started yesterday Sunday around 12 finished by 6 and today it took me about another two hours to try and, and seal it and make it look perfect I mean, as you can see, if you're comparing to the other side, it actually looks better, I would say. But, um, yeah, man, it took me a good amount of time. I thought it was going to be an easy, quick fix, but um, I, I put in a lot of work. Put in a lot of work, a lot of tools. So, as you can see, we still got that corner right there that's still open a little bit. So, I bought some... Uh, I don't know what it's called really, but um, it should fill up the hole. Uh, this I got from Home Depot, and I think it should be able to fill out fill out that corner right there. It's, it's not a big corner, so hopefully that that would do the job. But um, yep, it's on there. You know, the new cap. And wanted twenty five hundred dollars to fix that corner. You know, again, it's not perfect, but it's not going to stop us from, you know, doing work. Um, but um, um, all right, so I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Anyway, so as y'all can see, I put that stuff on there. It just bubbles up and it just holds it. So I don't. Know, hopefully, there's no water that's going to be going in there. But you know, it's temporary. Eventually we'll fix it. You know, if it holds, then we're gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it alone because if it's working, we ain't gotta fix it. If it holds and no water is leaking over there, then we're good. It just you could just see the damage from the side, really. But when you come to the front, you know, there's really nothing. Everything is perfect. So you know, I got lucky, man. I got lucky for this one. You know, again, they wanted twenty five hundred to fix that, so. That's 2500 in my pocket. You know, eventually, you know, we'll see how it goes. But as you can see, man, it's... It looks perfect from the front. The lights work. So, hey, that's all it matters. So, yeah. That's it. The lights are working, so everything is good. All right, man, the job is done. Saved us some $2,500, so, you know, lesson learned. It's not just about watching for bridges. <laughs> Gotta look out for the trees too, man. <laughs> it's crazy. But um, yeah, man, it could have been worse, you know, but, uh, you know, we dodged a bullet right now, so. It's been a crazy two days, man, I just been trying to fix it you know and um yeah it's hard it's definitely hard to put it back on there taking it is easy but to put it back and the rivet gun that i was using wasn't really doing the work too so i mean we put everything on there but um hopefully it'll hold it should hold um but yeah finally done today's monday we got some loads starting tomorrow Tomorrow night till about Sunday. We got like 11 loads till about Sunday. So 
We're back to work now. Um, but yeah, man, you know, again, you know, this business is not always about just making money. You know, sometimes you might get into a situation like this where, you know, it could have been worse. And you might have to put the truck in the shop for a few days, a week, who knows. But, um, yeah, man, I'm just glad that, you know, it wasn't that bad and we was able to fix it. You know, um, I don't know. Share comments. Let me know how, how you think I did on the job. All right, and I'm just tired, man. It's been a crazy two days, so I'm I'm signing out. Peace out. We'll catch up on the next video. Later.